Guys, welcome to this tutorial on a dock for your computer. It can either go at the top, bottom, left, or right of your screen, and it has great features, and it's lightweight, does not slow down your computer, and it's virus-free. Rocket Dock is pretty old, so it's about 3-4 years ago, um, from 2007, and it's pretty great, and they still haven't updated it. So to get this program, go to www.rocketdock.com, which is at this site. Once you arrive at this page, just click on the video if you want to see a review about it. Simply click on download, and once you're at this page, just click on download Rocket Dock. Go ahead and install it. So once you have Rocket Dock installed, the features on it is that you can minimize windows to the dock, which is like the Mac. So when I have this, I just minimize it, it goes there. So um, to basically put it at the bottom or right left side of your screen, right click on the dock or an icon, click on screen position, you can choose bottom, left, or right. I'm going to choose bottom and you'll notice it's kind of covered by the taskbar so right click on the dock, click on dock settings and I'm just going to click on position and set the edge offset on top of it and if I go to style and I choose the theme to a uh, Mac theme here which I can't find I must be blind but yeah you get to choose it here for a theme so if you want to look for themes for this dock you can just go to the website which is rocketdog.com click on get add-ons and once you're here you can choose through the categories icon skins or docklets since I want a skin I'm gonna click on skins and I'm gonna type up here Mac uh, it must be longer than the wrong well, whatever you retard uh, put Apple I'm gonna put Apple so um, once that's done, you choose skins, rock dog, so Mac OS leopard skin. If you want this theme, I'll post it in the description. And here it is. I'm just going to scroll down and click on download file. It'll automatically save it to my desktop and I'll be and it should be done. So basically to install skins for Rocket Dock, uh, download the file from the website, which I just showed. Right click on the file, click on WinZip and extract here. To get programs in order to extract this, go to www.winzip.com, rarlab.com, or 7zip.com, .org, actually. So, uh, once it's extracting it, you should have an icon on your desktop, or, yeah, on your desktop of the theme you downloaded. So, if you have Rocket Dock on your desktop, the icon, right-click on the icon, click on Properties, and click on Open File Location to get to the location faster. So um, once you're here, just click on Skins, and that file we downloaded in and extracted, drag in the folder into this folder. So once you have that done, right click on the Rocket Dock, Dock Settings, click on Style, and choose the theme to the one we just downloaded. You will notice that it kind of extended, and search for the name of the file we downloaded. So now I have the dock, which is pretty cool. So that's how you install themes on it. Later I will show how to install icons, but no need because I have a video popping out right now on how to install icons on Rocket Dock. So click on that if you want to customize the icons here. So what else you can do here, um, if you go to general, you can choose run at startup, minimize windows to dock, which I just showed earlier. Um, running applications indicator, which shows that it's running. Let's say I have Microsoft Word open. Oops, one second. So I have Microsoft Word open, it shows an arrow under that that program that it's running. So that's a great feature. What else you can do on uh, Rocket Dot? It's fully customizable. You can choose the icons, the quality to the best quality, high quality. I, I suggest doing that. You can choose the hover effect to bubble, plateau, which makes it like that, or flat, which is pretty ugly, like that. You choose, but I'm going to go back to bubble. You can choose how big you want to zoom in. The biggest is 128 pixels, which is pretty big, so I'm just going to go to 32 pixels, which is fine with me. Um, there's behavior. You can choose auto hide and the icon att attention effect. If I choose urban icon effects, I open it up. It gives a great feature. I'm gonna, just going to choose bounce. When I open up the application, it bounces up. Um, I suggest putting on auto hide or not. I don't like that. Make sure when you're in general, you set it, uh, where is that? My bad. Uh, click on position and the layering to normal. If you put always on top, which is pretty annoying, you have a window open. It's always going to be in front of you, which is terrible. Ah, crap. 
which is always going to be in front of you and it's pretty annoying and you don't want that unless you want to so if I were you go into dock settings of the dock and set the layering to normal so it can be below the windows and yeah you can choose the edge offset on how off you want it since I want it like the Mac I'll put it like that centering put it like that and whichever way I want so that's rocket dock and go ahead and get it at the website and I basically showed all the features that are on it thanks for watching guys and subscribe goodbye